Gerash versus Uther. I will fight with honor. Victory or death. Early board presence somewhat important. Ah, this looks like a hand. Turn one secret. It's not repentance. It's probably avenge. It's usually avenge. I didn't. I didn't keep attention if he kept it though. If it was just a random secret, then. Hmm. I think I checked for yeah. Ah, oh, god damn it. <laughs> In this case I definitely like should have hit first, but uh, you never know. Maybe the knife doesn't hit. Um probably muster. Okay. Never mind. Don't hit. Not repentance again. It's not competitive spirit. Noble sack, second redemption, revenge, competitive spirit. No, not competitive spirit. It's scientists with all these like one mana secrets don't really seem that worthwhile. I could play around most secrets by hitting this and using Whirlwind. Hmm. If he gets a Venge, I probably have to slam. Like if this gets avenged. Never mind. I think I just play on curve then. Good thing I kept the slime, I guess. Not competitive spirit again. It's a way to play around Noble Sag. But I flow too much mana by doing this. Still not repentance. I won't play around the. Uh, I'll play. I think there was. Yeah. Was only one Noble Sacrifice so far. The only thing for him to come back into the game is, uh, well the only two things are like Dr. Six and, uh, but he played a lot of secrets already, this will put out another one, um, or, um, Divine Favor. I wonder. I can take the hit. I think there's no need to play Belcher. Just floating mana. I should use my mana as efficient as possible to play around Divine Favor. If I can. Reporting for duty. Thanks, Dark, for the following. Welcome to the stream. See, now I can play something like this. Um, 
so we had ruled out a lot of stuff already. Doesn't matter. What now? Of course. Of in this case, I should have done it the other order, of course. Um, don't really want to trade here, but... I if I don't want to execute, which I don't, it seems alright still. Okay. We got all the secrets. Uh, we got most secrets out of the way already. In case of him playing Mysterious Challenger, like two Noble Sacrifice. Okay, good thing I kept the Whirlwind. But now I just need something that I can play. Actually, I should ask myself the question if there was a reason to attack, attack first with a weapon the last turn. I mean, Noble Sacrifice was a consideration, so probably not. Would have been better. Well, whatever. Um, it's definitely a whirlwind. Do I play the Armorsmith first? Not really. Um, we haven't seen the second redemption yet. Actually, why, when, when did he play this? I lost track of the game. <laughs> um... Hmm. No. I'm not sure what this is. It's not repentance, it's not redemption. It's not obviously not noble sang. Probably adventure competitive spirit. Reporting for duty. That's a great one. Strike. Kind of like the idea of playing revenge instead of the whirlwind. I just realized. Garrosh versus Rexa. Let the hunt begin. Victory or death! Should be hard. Oh, it's kind of close. If you got a high main or rang rang rem wrangler. <laughs> I guess I just equipped my death spide. Could shield slam it, but doesn't seem worth it. I don't want to override my weapon either. Okay, I'm glad it's it's not 
me who thinks that this is a tongue twister. <laughs> I kinda don't have anything to play here. But with hitting this? Yeah, pretty much. I mean, I want to draw off the Acolyte. Strike. Not doing anything this turn feels rather weak though. You can coin high main. There we go. Okay. It's almost worse. Uh, let's see if I draw an execute. A bash. Bash doesn't quite do it. Armor up shield slam is also, huh? Like I don't want to put too many resources into this. I could like bash shield slam or something weird. Can I take nine? Puts me down to sixteen. Seems alright. Given that I get a three three and a draw. I also have these two. Oh, I've been inside that thing for months. I can simply shield slam this now. It's not too big of an issue, right? Anything better? Nah, no, that's pretty I can good. Take the hit. Probably Handmaster too, yeah. If I could have gotten re rid of all the beasts, I probably would have done it to protect my guy from sh uh, kill command. Or to make Hunter's Mark worse. But yeah, there we go. I can play exactly these two, that's pretty good. Is this an explosive trap? Race for impact. He gave me a shield maiden, okay. And two cards. That's pretty generous. That belongs in a museum. Still haven't drawn any executes yet. Why didn't he just play boom? Does this make any sense? So da, da, da. freezing probably. Nope.
I can simply trade my guys into boom then. Or whatever comes up. I guess that's an okay whirlwind since it guarantees 8 damage to his face. Sniper bots. Barian seems pretty worthless so far. Yeah, that's right, but I see. It sometimes isn't. <laughs> huh. Okay. I think I can't guarantee lethal, right? I should have drawn the card first, but it should be alright. Well <laughs> Usain Colt. Interesting. I wonder if I should have kept and execute, but I have so much early removal with all these spells. Yeah, like these two, for example. <laughs> oh, execute is back in action also. So I guess I want him to double innovate coin boom or something. Not even sure if I want to drop my acolyte now. Probably. Oh, another enemy. I wonder if this hand is worth getting reduced, or if this was just like, well, I have this now and I have a curve afterwards. Uh, I think I don't execute it. I mean, I have the amount of damage I need on the board. I think I can also afford to play one of these. I mean, of course he can trade one for one, but he doesn't want to reveal it. And it might be an execute trigger because I have lost all my execute triggers. If he, like, coins out boom now or something. For six. Seems worth executing to get rid of it. Could need a shield slam though. Seven. Eight. Let the 
Could want to attack because of this. This trade is pretty good for him. Yeah. This doesn't make it too bad for him either, though. Dread seemed to do well. It's like the first really high ranked opponent today. Like top 100. This is an interesting choice though. I mean, if you have a Wrath, I would like suspect him to Wrath this one or this one. Not too. I mean, he could have just hero powered this down. So it seems like he wants. He needs the cards even though he still has 6 plus coin. No one. Or maybe he just has another card like Swipe or something that he wants to use. Or Keeper. Maybe he had Keeper in hand already. It's still worry. Okay. Well, you can of course just try to. Mm. I guess I just trade and play Rag. If I don't hit a minion, I probably die to combo. 9 plus 14, 23, 27? Yeah. My hero power can <laughs> target minions. Okay, fine. Basically a 50-50 for the BGH. So many cards. I have to fatigue him, it looks like. And the two mana BGH. I've got yep. a beast in my side. Uh. If I hit this, I die to... I almost die to combo. What did I say 27 for this? This is a very, like, draw-heavy druid with double Azure Drake. Hmm. So even if I do this, I go up to exactly 28. Which puts me in, still in a somewhat bad position. Um, I just do this. I can read this is 21, I'm still dead. Actually, I die to everything basically if he has combo, which he should have by now, so. Ah. If not, then maybe the Varian might what save me. I must safeguard the land. Unleash the beast. Great. Still no shield slimes yet. Do I just spoil one to hit this for one? Mm. Are now waiting on Shield Slam to play Maiden? Oh. I haven't found a time to play Maiden yet. Realistically, but yeah, this would be nice to remove something. Unleash the beast. Wow, the value.
Hmm. How am I not dead yet? 21. Um. Get down to 12, go up to 17. I still die to combo even if I kill two of these. I don't have belchers anymore. I don't have anything really that saves me. I guess we just pretend that it's not combo druid. Or he just, yeah, or he just runs one force of nature and haven't found it yet. Still pretty poor board. Wow, look at this. He's like at 7 cards. I'm at 13. Even though I played 2 Acolytes already, none of them got silenced. I mean, he hasn't played this card. I'm, I'm pretty sure that this is the only card that is still discounted. It might be a Savage Roar. Oh, now we'll find out. Okay, was a card he... Okay, it's not a Savage Roar. He wanted to play it now. Huh. Then I don't know. Swipe? Keeper. Okay. So if I play Varian now, I go down to... I hit this. Even if I pull out the second Armorsmith, I would go down to like, I don't know, 5... No, I go down to 7, maybe to 10. No. 10 means I'm... He didn't play a single swipe yet, right? Oh man, I'm so dead. <laughs> uh, well, whatever. I can take the hit. Um. Next turn, finally, variant turn. If I live. It's a big if, though. But this protects. kinda protects me from swipe. Like, he can't double swipe me. Okay. But he can swipe this, of course. Armor! Oh, this was discounted. Okay. Okay, I'll just play this guy now. We're aware that the Tavern Brawl <laughs> currently active in Hearthstone is incorrect and we're working to activate the too many portals. Great, so I played the wrong one again. I cannot do that. This is 6. Swipe is 10. I'm not dead. Behold, the armies of No minion? No minion. <laughs> and no minion. What a great turn. Finally combo. Yeah. Six plus six, twelve. Still missing five. Seriously? Is he just messing with me? Or are like. Are two of the five last cards Savage Roars? 
I'm kind of confused. So he had a force for quite some Okay, there's the savage draw. Well played. <laughs> uh. He actually could have just played like double force to kill me. Uh, whatever. 